I think about that microbiome sort of like a garden. When you have a garden, you have certain plants that you want to grow. You might have tomato plants, you might have red peppers, you might have zucchini. And then you also have things like weeds and other components. And all of those things play a role in how well the garden grows. And you don't want too much zucchini or, or tomato plants that get too big. You certainly don't want too many weeds either. Well, the microbiome is very similar. You have strains of bacteria that are healthy. You have ones that are unhealthy. You have ones that are healthy, but when there are too much of them, then they become unhealthy too. And then you have the soil, right, as well, which is our intestines. So you have all of these components and they have to be in a good mix so this way, they put out the right chemicals, they put out the right metabolites, which go to the brain via the vagus nerve and helps the brain stay healthy. So like a good garden, you wanna feed your microbiome properly so it stays in good balance.